for the Wrestle Force Undisputed Championships. It was held by James Farrell, who sadly lost it Wednesday in Tunbridge. He would like to get it back. We have a new champion in town who, for the first time tonight, is putting on that belt. It's his first defense. Let's meet the wrestlers for our championship match. Welcome back to WrestleForce TV. It is main event time here in Aylesbury. And what a huge opportunity for the man about to burst through the door, Kieran Lacey. Tonight, he is challenging the WrestleForce Undisputed Champion. And it's not James Farrell because he lost the title Wednesday in Tunbridge to Michael Oku. Michael Oku making a return to singles action in WrestleForce and in a huge shock, defeating James Farrell to become the new undisputed WrestleForce champion. I use the word shocking because it was shocking, but it wasn't an upset. Michael Oku is one of the top wrestlers in the country, one of the most decorated wrestlers in the country, a former British Cruiserweight champion. And of course, not to take away from the pedigree of James Farrell, and I'm sure James Farrell will be looking to regain that championship. However, will he be looking to regain it from Michael Oku himself, or will Kieran Lacey be the new champion after tonight? Kieran Lacey has been so impressive, especially as of late. Will he be able to win the big one tonight? This contest is officially recognised as being for the Wrestle Force Undisputed Championship and belt. If you wrestle with one fall, one submission, or one knockout, then it's time for winner. Introducing to you the challenger, at last, a shot at a title he well deserves, earning the respect of every other wrestler in the business. One of the finest, welcome the challenger, Kieran Lacey! And you hear that reception for Kieran Lacey. He's a firm fan favourite, and with good reason. And uh, so now, last week we had the crowning of a brand new champion. Let's beat him as he puts up his title on his first defence. And now making his way to the ring for the first time since becoming undisputed WrestleForce champion from Old Street in London, the master of the half crab, Michael Oku. The former longest reigning British Cruiserweight champion and now the top dog here in WrestleForce, the man to beat the undisputed WrestleForce champion defending his championship for the first time against someone who I would call the heart and soul of WrestleForce, Kieran Lacey. And in his backstage comments after winning the title in Tonbridge, Michael said that that championship may be the most meaningful win of his career. WrestleForce, a company that gave Michael an opportunity early on in his career uh, when no other company could. Then, the man with both belts from Hackney in London, the formidable talent, whether it's from style, submission style, brawler, whatever. Now we play the defending champion, Michael Oku! And how meaningful it is for Michael Oku to come back to one of the first promotions to take a chance on a young kid from London. And now he stands in the middle of the ring as your undisputed WrestleForce champion. Calls the decide the winner takes both belts. Undisputed Wrestle Force Champion or referee in charge, Martin Prince.
Martin Raymondson holding up the two belts that compromise the WrestleForce Undisputed Championship in the air. Who will be the man that goes home with both belts? This crowd here in Ellsbury are ready. Good luck to both And Kieran Lacey, always the sportsman, extends the hand. That's what we love to see, ladies and gentlemen. Lock up. Both men have a lot of respect for each other, but they both have a point to prove. Michael Oku looking to prove that his win not an upset, and Kieran Lacey looking to prove that he belongs not only in the main event scene, but he belongs to be on top of the mountain as WrestleForce Undisputed Champion. You can see that look in Michael Oku's eyes, determined and focused as ever. The same look mirrored on the face of Kieran Lacey. The WrestleForce wrestling ring, a second home to Kieran Lacey. Lives and breathes the sport of professional wrestling, lives and breathes WrestleForce. And what a chop from Kieran Lacey. Sticking it to the champion. And again, giving the crowd what they want. Oh, and another huge arm drag, nice and deep. Michael Oku puts the brakes on the second one. Kieran Lacey goes behind. Score by! Score by! Oh, and only a two. And Michael Oku was in danger of losing his championship belt on the first defense. Kieran Lacey with another roll up. Oh, and at two again. Michael Oku kicks out. Kieran Lacey is staying on him. Into the corner. It's an O'Connor roll. Oh, and again. Michael Oku kicks out. A crossbody! A crossbody! And Mike, Michael Oku surely been shocked by the pace of Kieran Lacey. Kieran Lacey storming right out of the gate. And I think that is the tactic that Kieran Lacey needs to deploy here. And he's looking for that signature pile driver. He's been winning many matches with that as of late. Hoist him up again. If he hits that pile driver, it could be over. We could see a new champion crowned here in Aylesbury. Oh, no, Michael Oku. Oh, and he sends him crashing to the outside. Kieran Lacey hitting the small of his back on that apron. And Michael Oku now to the outside. with a chop of his own. And you can see the pain on the face of Kieran Lacey. Oh, and he drops him back first, spine first onto that steel beam. The edge of the ring where the steel meets the wood, my God. Kieran Lacey laid out on the floor. And Michael Oku, I think he's going to try and take the count out victory. Champion's advantage. Michael Oku can win this match anyway. Kieran Lacey has to win it inside the ring. Pinfall or submission. Disqualification and count out doesn't count. Kieran Lacey needs to get back in the ring. Oh, and at the count of nine. Before the count of 10, Kieran Lacey makes it back in, but the damage has already been done, ladies and gentlemen. 
Kieran Lacey having to use the ropes to pull himself up. And Michael Oku unloading them, a huge back club. And this is a more vicious side of Michael Oku than we're used to seeing. Drops the elbow on that already damaged back. And Kieran Lacey, he's fighting back. A series of strikes. Another European uppercut has Michael Oku on the ropes. He grabs his arm and he goes to send him off at Michael Oku counters. Oh, and a huge backbreaker there from Michael Oku. And referee Martin Raymond's in there checking on Michael. And Kieran Lacey slowly pulls himself to his feet. My God, what a chop! Michael Oku, oh, he sends Kieran Lacey into the corner, and Kieran Lacey goes shoulder first into that turnbuckle, into that steel hook with just a thin layer of padding on it. He goes shoulder first. And Michael Oku, full head of steam, but nobody home, and Michael Oku lands on his neck. Michael Oku with that documented history of neck problems, landing on his neck, you can see him grabbing it in pain. Could this be the opening Kieran Lacey needs? And Kieran Lacey could be looking for that X-Plex. No, Michael Oku twists out. And it's another big chop, another big chop from Kieran Lacey. Kieran Lacey unloading on the champion. Michael Oku sends Kieran Lacey into the corner, and we saw that in Tunbridge! Such innovative offense from Kieran Lacey. I have no idea what to call it, a twisting crossbody out of the corner with an Eddie Guerrero twist. The challenger is taking it to the champion. Could Kieran Lacey be about to end the championship reign of Michael Oku at just five days? Oh, and Michael Oku nearly takes Kieran Lacey's head off. Oh, and Kieran Lacey with a huge clothesline. And he plants the champion of an x -Plex. And Kieran Lacey, he could be looking for that Kieran crash down. He heads to the middle of the apron. Will Kieran Lacey be able to pull it off? Injured arm, injured back. Oh no, Michael Oku puts the knees up. He puts the knees up, he drives all the wind out of the challenger. And now it's Michael Oku who takes to the top rope. He's feeling froggy. It's Kieran Lacey with the knees up! Frog splash denied! Come on, Kieran! Come on, Kieran! Michael Oku coming down with such force, I think he, Kieran Lacey's hurt his knee! Michael Oku might have broken a rib, 
What an incredible main event here in Ellsbury, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Referee Martin Raymondson's at a count of, he's at a count of five now. Could this end in a draw? Neither man is to their feet yet. A draw would mean a defense broker, it would mean he retains. No, both men showing signs of life and referee Martin Raymondson calls off the count. Oh, and a big strike there from Kieran Lacey. The challenger showing a lot of heart, a lot of soul. Oh, and a big back club. Kieran Lacey started this match at such a frantic pace, but as the match has gone on and both men have done so much damage to each other, you can see that the gas tank, that cardiovascular conditioning of both men is really being pushed to the limits. Kieran Lacey, a chop to the champion. And the champion fires back with a club to the back. Look at that determination on the face of Kieran Lacey. He will not die. A chop to the back. Kieran Lacey wants nothing more in this world than to be WrestleForce champion. WrestleForce undisputed champion. And the man that stands in the way of him and his goal has just kicked him in the head. And Michael Oku was looking for that half crab, but Kieran Lacey hits the ends of Gurley. What does Kieran have in mind here? 404! Brain not found! And Kieran Lacey kicks out! And Michael Oku back to the top rope. He tried to hit this earlier in the match, but he was thwarted. He's looking for that fox splash, will he hit it? Can he hit it? He saw the knees, he saw the knees, he landed on his feet and now he's looking for that signature half crab. This is how he won the championship. Kieran Lacey's kicking out, he's fighting his way out. Hang on, what is Michael Oka gonna do here? He looks to catapult Kieran Lacey out the ring, but Kieran Lacey with that phenomenal core strength holding on. Kieran Lacey holds on, prevents himself being catapulted outside the ring. Oh, but Michael Oku with a Pele kick. <laughs> Kieran Lacey moved out of the way, and now Michael Oku is in the drop zone. He's in perfect position for the Kieran crash down. The Kieran crash down. Goodness with 2.9, the uh, Michael Oku kicks out. Kieran Lacey can't believe it. This crowd here in Aylesbury can't believe it. He's looking for it. That signature pile driver, if he hits it, we could see a new champion. No, Michael Oku picks the leg. He picks the leg. Kieran Lacey kicks him off. Oh, and a super kick! A huge super kick to the head of the challenger, Michael Oku, for the third time, looking for that frog splash. He's feeling froggy! Five star frog splash! And Kieran Lacey kicks out again! Kieran Lacey will not die! Oh, and he's got that half crab sunk in deep. This is how he won the championship. This is how he made James Royal submit. This is how James, this is how James Royal tapped out in Tunbridge. This is how Michael Oku cemented himself as the top dog here in WrestleForce. Kieran Lacey is crawling. He's inching towards the ropes. Referee Martin Raymond's in perfect position to see it. Can Kieran Lacey hold on? Can he hold on? 
determination on the face of Kieran Lacey, the fire and passion in the eyes. He makes it to the bottom rope. What an incredible contest we are witnessing here on WrestleForce TV, ladies and gentlemen. And once again, Kieran Lacey finds himself on the outside. At this point, he must just be desperately trying to catch his breath. And once again, Michael Oku can take the count out victory. But Kieran Lacey, it's just pinfall or submission for him. Michael Oku is back to his feet and hang on. Hang on, Michael Oku, I don't think he's gonna take the count out victory. He's running a lap. What's he looking for here? The fast way flop! Perfectly executed, landing on his feet! The WrestleForce champion launching his body over the top rope. Both men absolutely exhausted, but fighting through the pain because the WrestleForce Undisputed Championship means everything to both these men. The champion is on his feet. The challenger laid out in the center of the ring. Familiar battle cry, but Kieran Lacey with a small package! Kieran Lacey with a small package! Oh, at 2.9! At 2.9 he kicks out! Michael Oku ducked the first kick, but the second one hit the mark! He's got him in position! Can he lift him up? He has him up! A pile driver! A pile driver right in the middle of the ring! That's it! That's it! My goodness, the champion got his foot on the rope! I am speechless, ladies and gentlemen. I thought that was a new champion crowned. Kieran Lacey's absolutely shocked. He could feel that Michael Oku didn't kick out, but he's just seen his foot on the bottom rope. Kieran Lacey has to be heartbroken, but he's got to stay on him. He's got to stay on him if he wants to leave Aylesbury. He's the new undisputed WrestleForce champion. He picks the champion up one more time. He's hauling him to his feet. Hang on, he packs him into the corner. What's he looking for here? Kieran Lacey using every last bit of strength in his body. He puts the champion on the top rope and hang on. Hang on, what is this? Is he going to try? He's, he's going to try and throw him from the top rope. It's an overhead press. It's an overhead press. Oh, the champion rolls him up. No, he transitions. He transitions into the half crab and he's got it sunk in deep. He's got it sunk in deep right in the middle of the ring. The champion has the half crab sunk in. How long can Kieran Lacey survive? Kieran Lacey turns it round. Oh my goodness. Michael Oku with a running drop kick to the face. And Michael Oku climbing the top rope. Kieran Lacey, face and in the middle of the ring. Oh, and it's a frog splash to the back. And he goes straight into the half crab. Kieran Lacey once again finding himself in the half crab. How many more times can Kieran Lacey fight his way out of this? Out of the most devastating hold in the champion's arsenal. He's right in the middle of the ring. Michael Oku is sunk as deep as he can go. He sat on that lower back that's already been damaged so much. And oh no, Michael Oku pulls him back to the middle, back to the middle. And I said that was as deep as he can go, but he cinches it in further. He leads back and it's a tap out. The champion retains by submission. What an incredible contest here in Ellsbury, ladies and gentlemen. What an epic battle. What an amazing first defense for Michael Oku. What an incredible fight from Kieran Lacey. Ladies and gentlemen, after a hard-fought, dreamy performance.
international contest with both men. What excellent athletes both of these men are. But the winner and still the undisputed WrestleBoss champion, Michael Oko. A defence to put him on the map, but what an incredible effort from Kieran Lacey. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, he gave him a real, real battle. And that's what championship wrestling is all about. A worthy challenger. Not this time, maybe next time, Kieran Lacey. Kieran Lacey, you should be so proud of yourself. What an incredible fight. Oh, he came to defend his title for the first time. It's the win. Your champion is Michael Oko. But that is why Michael Oko is the undisputed champion. That's why he's the top dog. One of the most brilliant main event matches I have ever had the pleasure of commentating on here in WrestleForce. Kieran should be so proud of himself, and so should Michael. Another day. A full contest with two fine athletes. Thank you, gentlemen. Kieran Lacey and your champion, Michael Oku. There is that mutual respect, ladies and gentlemen. Real recognises real, and it doesn't get much more real than Kieran Lacey. But once again, still, your undisputed Reservoir's champion after one of the most incredible championship matches I have ever seen, the master of the half crab, Michael Oku. Thank you for joining us on Reservoir TV, ladies and gentlemen. It's matches like that which are the exact reason you should be subscribed. Please leave a like, please leave a comment. We will see you again soon. Please check out our future dates at WrestleForce.com. Giovanni Giorgio, signing out.